Hi guys, Mardok here. I hope you are well. In the previous video, I have shown you how to make a simple rope ball or a basket. Today, we are going to upgrade that project with a handle. The result is a nice looking basket that you can use either as a flower basket at a wedding, you can use it as a flower pot holder, or as my kids do, you can use it to carry around crayons. For the handle, you're going to need about 4 feet of rope, a bit of tape, I really like using masking tape, a fed or a Swedish fed, and a pair of scissors. Here is how we add in our handle. You take one end of your rope, you pass it through an opening in your basket. Unravel your end. Secure the three ends. Unravel about a foot. Bring your ends and your rope together like this. Work the three ends into your rope. This process is called splicing. So the first strand The second strand and our last strand. So you can see that this top strand is a bit away from the other two. So I'm going to bring these two up to the point of the top strand. So this one, the middle one, passes over under. The bottom one passes over under over under. Our 
our three strands are now at the same point in our rope. Now tie a foot rope knot. Take one of your strands, pass it counterclockwise over the next strand. The next one passes counterclockwise over the next strand. The last strand passes into the loop created by the first strand. Tighten up. This is the so-called crown knot. Take a strand, pass counterclockwise under the next strand, double up the strand that you're using here at the top, going under one. With your next strand, again counterclockwise under the next strand, double up the strand that you're using here at the top. The last of our strands passes here over two, under here, and doubles itself up. At the top, like this, going under two, here. So this is pretty much the foot rope knot. To finish it up, take one of your strands, double up this bottom strand, passing over two, and through the center of our foot rope knot. The next strand again doubles up the strand here at the bottom, going over two, then through the center of the foot rope knot. The final strand again doubles up this bottom strand, passing over two, then through the center of our foot rope knot. You can now tighten up the knot, starting here where your strand comes into your knot from the splice, going through your knot, into one of your ends. Do the same thing with your other two strands. So like this, a nice looking foot rope knot. We now move opposite 
to our first set here, attaching our rope onto the other side of our basket. Remember, we unravel about a foot of our ends. Then, as you can see, we do the same thing here on the left. So we pass our strands over our rope, we work our strands into our handle, Get the three ends to the same spot, so the middle one goes over under, the bottom one goes over under, And again, over under. Then again tie a foot rope knot. Tighten up your foot rope knot. Then trim the six ends.
And that's our handle. So guys, we've made a beautiful basket that you can be proud of. Thank you for joining me. See ya next time.